save her. My daughter. How's it going guys? Lucian Sword here, playing some more Breath of the Wild for you today as always. Even though it's a beautiful sunset right here, we're actually just starting the episode. Um, this is Gerudo Desert and I want to explore it a little bit today. But before we do that guys, it's been bugging me that I need electric key swings. And I need them to upgrade my climbing gear to level 2. There's only just a couple electric key swing that I need and um, the only place that I remember for certain where they were was when we were traveling up the Zoro's domain so I'm gonna warp here to the Nehru tower real quick and we're gonna go grab some electric key swing because I'm pretty sure there's like a cave with like 10 of these electric keys and they each are probably gonna drop two wings Hope, well, you would think. So, after we do that, then we'll come back to the desert. And um, we'll start looking for the Great Fairy Fountain in the desert. Because I know that there is one somewhere in there. There's also a bunch of cool shrines. And eventually we're going to do the Divine Beast as well in that area. Alright, so this is... This is it. I pretty much just want to go... This way. Oh, there's a Henox down there. There's a Henox, like right here. I'll put a, I'll put a bow and arrow there to remember. I don't really want to fight these guys. Shock resistance is actually perfect for this area, but. Big hardy radish. Okay, so these are like the tunnels, I remember. So if we follow this path, for sure we're going to come across some electric keys. Probably shouldn't use my light arrows yet. Boom. Found one. That is what I want, guys. That is what I want. I knew that we would find them here. Look at this. There's so many up here. Ha! <laughs> yes. Give me the key swings. Now we can upgrade our climbing gear. Alright, that's all I wanted. That should be enough. I got 11. Uh, let's head back to, oh man, there, this, do you guys remember this star? This was an area where I could hear Cass playing a song, but I couldn't get to him because I didn't have Revali's Gale. Well, now I have Revali's Gale, so I kind of want to check that out. I also want to go up here, uh, to this heart-shaped lake. We did not go up here. See the hero's path? We just completely avoided that. Um... Yeah, let's do that. A little bit of a side quest. I don't really have a rush to get to Gerudo Desert. Because there's just so much to do. But I do want to get to Gerudo Desert as our next area. Uh, I just want to... I want to check out what Cass was doing over here. We... We <laughs> we, we heard him, like, what was this, like 20 episodes ago? I just want to check him out now that we have uh, Falco's Gale, as Summer says. So, otherwise we might forget. Alright, so I just need to follow the road. Oh, 
Summoning in Cookie. Let's go, Cookie. What are we near Lurlin Village? Oh, we are. Yeah. Nope, not hanging out at Lurlin Village. I could hear the music. Probably a quest that I need to do over there, but I, I still, uh, yeah. There was a quest where I had to clear out like a fishing camp or whatever. I never did. We have to do that at, at some point as well. But first, I really want to know what Cass was doing over in these uh, cliffs. Oh gosh, we have, we have somebody needs help. How are these not headshots? You all right, buddy? Huh. It blows my mind that anyone bothered to save a sad sack like me. How could I ever thank you? Uh, do you want this? Sure. Thanks, Regan. Who's this? <laughs> hey, uh, we I'm feeling so darn good today. I think I might head south of here to Lover's Pond and try to find myself a partner. Yes, sir. That's where we're going, Lover's Pond. Let's go, Cookie. Yeah. But first, let's see what Cass was doing up on these cliffs. He better still be there. I'm pretty sure that's why I put the star over here. What is that? Oh, it's a dragon up there. Whoa. Alright, is this where I could hear him? Could I even be able to get up there even with Falco's Gale? Oh man. I think if we eat some uh, stamina items, we might be able to get up there. Oh, that completely gave me full stamina. I hear him! Cass, where are you? He's got to be further up. <laughs> Cass, where are you, friend? Are you up here? You are really hard to get to, you know. I would have never been able to get up here without Revali's Gale. Where is he? I hear him, but I still don't see him. Is he at the top of this? Cass, you're driving me crazy. Where are you? I could hear you. Oh my gosh, he's way over there. How could I hear you from that far away, Cass? Look how far he was. Cass, what are you doing here? Very impressive. Not many could make it up here in such rain. You think? I'd expect no less from a well-worn traveler like yourself. Me? I stay nice and dry. My feathers repel the rain rather well. And my instrument was designed to withstand extreme moisture. Really? <laughs> okay. You know a song about this place. Of course you do. Let's hear it. Oh. 
when a lost hero calls down lightning from the sky. The monk responds from a giant mound on high. Alright, so I gotta put something metal there and lightning will strike it. Gotcha. Mm. Thank you, Cass. What might that be? Gosh, it is laggy in this area. The switch can barely handle it. Whoa! Okay, so this is the thing I gotta put up there. It, it just shocked that fish, guys. Did you see that? Ooh, it's a hearty bass. Don't want to let it go to waste, you know what I mean? This could be for like a Korok puzzle, but I think it's also just, we need to put it up there. Alright, it's up there. Is there a Korok puzzle around here though? Because that that's literally a Korok puzzle piece. I can't see anything. It's so rainy in this area. <laughs> Cass, you are crazy. Did it work? Wait. It didn't work? Oh, dragon. Lightning, please. I call upon you. Okay, now that I put this thing up here, the lightning doesn't want to go on it. Are you kidding me? How about uh, the edge of duality? Let's make a lot of uh, electricity right here. No? Oh, come on. It's striking all around me, but not not where I want it to. How come? It was just striking this thing a minute ago. Uh, let's read the quest log. Song of Storms. When a lost hero calls lightning down from the sky, the monk responds from a giant mound. Oh no, man. I'm pretty sure we gotta... Okay, it's doing it. It's doing it. There it goes. Where'd that little cube thing go? Do I I don't need it anymore? Okay, I guess it's gone. Hey, we found a shrine, guys. Cool. Then we won't have to climb back up here again. Just took a while, so we had the right idea. It just took a while. Let's see what we're getting ourselves into. Then I want to go check out Lover's Pond, and then we're going to go to Gerudo Desert and explore. Oh, it's just a blessing. Alright. Give me Giant Ancient Core. Oh! We found the rubber tights! Wow! I did not expect that. So now we have two pieces of rubber armor. Cool. I just need the top piece now. <laughs> oh man, that's kind of cool. I wonder where the rubber helmet is. Must just be in a shrine somewhere. I don't even remember where we found the rubber armor itself. I think it was in a shrine somewhere far away from here though. 
How many is that? Three? All right, one more, guys. One more spirit orb, and I get another stamina vessel. Maybe we'll get one at Lover's Pond. Let's see. Let's go back down to... Oh, it's not raining anymore! What? So solving that puzzle actually stopped the rain? Oh, that's amazing because this place is constantly thunderstorming. Now I can actually see. Awesome. Alright, let's head to Lover's Pond. I think it's up the mountain over here. Cookie, you are such a good horse. You waited so patiently for me. I thought these were little rock boys. I got Boulder Breaker. Go up this mountain, Cookie. I don't know why we're going the long way. Oh, that's probably the fishing camp that I gotta clear out. I bet you that's the one. I g <laughs> Dang, I really want to go to Gerudo Desert, but we just have all these quests right in front of us. I almost guarantee that's it. Let, let me look at the adventure log. So, it's probably not a shrine quest. It's probably just a side one. Luralind Village, take back the sea. Um... Yeah, it is. That's literally it. All I have to do is defeat the monsters on the beach. All right. Gale is now ready. We're gonna defeat the monsters, then we're gonna come back to Lover's yeah. Lake. That's a light arrow. There was only one monster on the beach, so I guess we're done. <laughs> uh, we probably gotta kill all these guys. Um. Let's see. What's a good way to get over there? Hi. Actually, you know what? You're not very waterproof, are you? I guess he's almost dead anyways. Now that is how you get up here. You really want to fight me? Have fun down there. Yep. <laughs> Bo Cobblins can't swim, guys. Just remember that. Oh, man. Don't blow it. Don't do it. Don't do it. Don't do it. Oh, boy. He did it. I bet you, yeah, there's probably treasure all around this area. Look at all the loot from the people I just killed. Should probably put on our uh, swimming gear. Ooh. 
Not bad, not bad. Might as well grab all this loot. I mean, free money, right? Man, this water is beautiful. Five arrows. Arrows are like gold, man. I really want arrows. Alright. Maybe uh, let's go back up this platform and then we can just hop right on over to the other one. You need to chill out with that horn. Alright, let's go up a little bit and then we'll jump over to that one. Anybody? Anybody? Anybody else? Anybody else? Oh, Silver Boy. Hi. Bye bye. Hey, buddy, I'm gonna need you to die. <laughs> Easy. We did it. See? Let's see what we got. All right. It's actually a really good spear. Um. Yeah, I guess I'm done using this. We'll take the good spear. That other one was probably getting ready to break soon anyways, you know what I mean? Um, so there was some more treasure, like... There's one right down there. Might as well go for him. Is a dragon near me? I suspect that there is. It got really windy all of a sudden. A royal broadsword. I don't see the dragon, actually. That's actually a really good one-handed weapon. So, let's get rid of... Hmm. Actually, I don't really have anything I want to get rid of right now, so... Oh, well. It got really windy all of a sudden. Alright, I think there's another chest over here, so let's just go look over here real quick. There it is. Give me something good! Alright, I'll take it. Alright, so we're done with this area. Man, it got really stormy all of a sudden. Alright, Cookie. We did it. We cleared out the fishing camp. Now we go into Lover's Pond. Man, I feel bad. I, I really wanted to do Gerudo Desert, but I don't like leaving loose ends either. Like, I want to do the side stuff before we do the main stuff. If that makes sense. So... That way we don't yeah. just forget to do it, you know what I mean? Yeah. Move, big boy. Yeah. Alright, we're almost yeah. to the top. Come on, Cookie. I know this is hard, but we can do it. I'm gonna... Ooh, actually I can't even set a fire. I was gonna set a fire so I could skip forward so it's not raining. Oh, hold on, Cookie. We got ore. Cannot pass up some beautiful ore. Rock salt. And... 
couple amber. Oh yeah, there's more up here. If I can get up there. Guess I don't really need Zora's armor on right now. Uh, let's just do climbing here, I guess. Rock salt. Now that I have the electric key swing, I can go upgrade my climbing gear as well. Alright, Cookie, I'm just gonna go the rest of the way here. This is it? Lover's Lake or Lover's Pond, right? We made it. It's a lot smaller pond than I thought it would be. Man, so many hardy radish up here. Savak. Savak. Hmm? I didn't think I'd meet you during a downpour. Are you... Could you be the Vo I'm destined to meet? Huh. No. No, I don't think so. But then, this is the Pond of Legend, is it not? The one where a person finds true love? Mm. Yet, all I see right now is that strange Vo on the other side of the pond. Could I be at the wrong one? No, you're at the right one. Uh. Ooh la la. Hey, I'm trying to work up the courage to, to talk to her. Just let me, yeah? No problem. <laughs> nope, rival time. Phew. Mm. I'm so glad. Oh, by the way, my name is Wabin. Aww. To be honest, I lost my way earlier. I closed my eyes for a minute. When I opened them, the most beautiful woman I've ever seen was standing before mm. me. At first, I thought I was dreaming or that she was a ghost or something. I mean, it's not every day you run into a gorgeous woman in the middle of nowhere. Uh. But, my, but figment of my imagination or not, it was love at first sight. And so I've decided to gather my courage and go confess my feelings to her. Well, what are you waiting for? I decided long ago that when I meet the girl of my dreams, I'll hand her a blue nightshade and confess my love. Aww. If I had a blue nightshade, I'd head straight over to that woman. Mm. Oh, you need one? Do I have a blue nightshade? I have to, right? Oh, you are in luck. I have 22 of them. Here you go, buddy. Go ahead. Thank you! This is perfect. It's exactly what I needed. Ooh la la! Go for it. Ah, I just ugh. When I look at her, my legs freeze up, my throat goes dry. I, I can't do it. Please, could you take my gift to her? Sure. Thank you. I'll give you back this blue nightshade. Oh my goodness. Are you kidding me? Don't forget to mention it was from me. Oh my gosh. I'm in middle school again. Oh, dang. That's actually a rare weapon. Dang, I have too many good weapons. Oh my gosh. I love every single weapon I have. This is unfortunate. Hmm? A gift from that guy. Hmm? I see. So you're delivering these flowers for that bow over there. I don't sense any deceit from you. She's got the blue nightshade. It's like downpouring. Uh -huh. So you're the one who gave me the flowers. Uh -huh. Eek, I'm sorry. Uh -huh. Could could it be that you don't like blue nightshade? Uh -huh. Why would you say that? This is my favorite kind of flower. How did you know that anyway? Are you a Yiga spy? Uh -huh. No, that's not, that's not it. Blue nightshade just happens to be my favorite flower. Long ago, I decided to give my true love this flower. Mm. Your true love. So this is what they call destiny. You're the vote that destiny has chosen for me then. All right, go ahead and speak your piece. Mm -hmm. What do you mean? No, that's not right at all. Uh. I'm talking about what a vote says to a vi. Oh. What do you mean? Huh? You know, something like, I like you, or please go out with me. Mm. Oh, uh, sure. Asking so directly, how could I possibly say no? Huh? What? Ah! <laughs> He thought that she was asking him. Oh, wow, did you hear that? She said she likes me and she wants to go out. This is the first time anyone has ever said they like me. <laughs> and for it to come from the woman of my dreams. This is such an amazing feeling. I'm so glad I was born into this world. Oh my gosh, dude. There's no way I could truly thank you, but please take this as a token of my thanks. 20 rupees. Huh? What? That's it? That's all you're willing to offer him for everything he's done for you? 
I, uh, no, of course not. Here, this is what I meant to give you. <laughs> much better. Hey you, I guess I owe you too. I hope you have as much luck finding someone as I did. Thanks to you. Whew. Those guys are definitely meant for each other. Well guys, I hate to, to end this video in the middle of a downpour. But rain is the giver of life and therefore it's a good thing. Just don't get struck by lightning. Let's go up to the top of this mountain and see if there's a Korok. I need more Koroks. Imagine if you could warp everywhere you found a Korok seed. That would actually be awesome. Alright guys, um, hopefully it's not raining next time. And definitely Gerudo Desert next time. I, I feel good now. We, we've, we've come here. We've done what we needed to do. I just hated seeing this area unexplored. We, we can actually take the star away now that we found Cass. We got the shrine. Oh man, feels good. Thank you guys so much for the support on this episode. If you have any suggestions of what you would like me to do next, uh, let me know because we don't have to go to Gerudo. We could do whatever you guys want. Uh, I, I do also want to do the sword trials, master sword trials. So if you want me to do that next, uh, just let me know. We could also explore up here. There's another maze right there that we could do in this whole area up here we didn't really explore. And the entire Gerudo Desert we didn't explore. Uh, Fair on Grasslands. There's also another labyrinth right there. So there's there's a lot that we could do. Uh, just let me know. Fair on Woods, we didn't really explore any of this at all. Such a shame. So anyways, guys, take it easy. Hope to see you next time.